Good morning, guys. Welcome to my third vlog, my blank page series. And yeah, my little morning routine. So I start every morning with a meditation. So um, I do without a clock. I just like, yeah, now I'm really good and just feeling when 30 minutes are over. So I just lose up a little bit and then I meditate in the darkness for 30 minutes. Then I do some yoga, I do it directly afterwards. Yeah, so this is the end. I like to stretch, cuddle up into a little ball, do that freaky kind of stuff where you get your head very close to your butt. Okay, and this is it, final stretch. And I better shut down this camera. But, ah. Then I mix on some hair mask. It's like, um, Colorless henna, and then I prepare my breakfast, cover it for later till I take a shower. Then I'm taking a shower and I have my hair mask on, and I'm doing some oil pulling. So, the only thing I really use oil for, besides moisturizing, and sometimes, yeah, sometimes it's sometimes gets in the throat, but it's okay. Um, and then it's like around 10 o'clock later so after breakfast I usually activate my phone again and checking some stuff not before and then on some days I yeah put a to-do list together just to know what I have to do because I'm editing and uploading a lot of times I do this to-do list on my laptop just to be like directly on there and yeah so I can keep track on all the things I have to do during the day. Magical, huh? Super magical. Finally, we have some sun here again. Isn't that nice? Also, my videos look better in the sun. It makes just so much more sense. Okay, like I told you, I started to take antibiotics because I had some staph infection um, that I want to get rid of after using natural remedies. Nothing did work, so I went to the last step of taking antibiotics. So a lot of you, um, I think, have to do it as well. I just want to give you um, some tips how to um, support your body while doing it and also afterwards to restore, rebuild your gut flora, so your beneficial gut bacteria. My three tips to support your body while you're taking antibiotics or afterwards would be number one my all-time favorite always hydration okay get your cells flush with water get your body flush with water okay get the hydration in um, special water caffeine free teas for example but I'm doing um, half a liter to one liter of warm water before every meal before every big meal um, for example 15 minutes or so beforehand and that really helps me with digestion in general you know like keep everything going if your diet is naturally high in fresh fruits and vegetables then of course you need a little bit less but th yeah that is the advantage um, in general of a diet rich in fresh fruits and vegetables which brings me to my second tip your diet Diet rich in fiber, fresh fruits and vegetables, grains, legumes, seeds, nuts. So this is what you will thrive on, okay? So as you know, our body consists to a high percentage of beneficial bacteria that um, assist our body in digestion and also absorption of nutrients. They also synthesize certain vitamins and of course help our or boost our immune system when tackling different viruses or harmful bacteria that want to attack our body. Of course you have to support those bacteria in your gut in regards to keep your body going and to be healthy. Right? So we know now that this beneficial bacteria in our gut is just 
essential for the general well-being and health. We call those foods also prebiotics um, because they support the bacteria that is already in your intestine. So for example, microbes produce acids when they're breaking down fiber, which discourages the growth of bad bacteria. Get your average foods inside and also foods that contain resistant starches, for example, grains, seeds, legumes, bananas, cooked and then cooled starches like potatoes and rice. Um, so all of these foods have a prebiotic role, which is emphasized a lot. When you're taking antibiotics, you're not only killing the harmful bacteria, you're also killing the good bacteria, right? And you don't want that. So if, if you're overall healthy, you might not need to um, supplement additional probiotics, but of course you can, so it's not harmful to supplement it anyways. If you're experiencing symptoms like um, antibiotic-associated diarrhea, which is a very common symptom, um, then it might be beneficial for you to supplement probiotics as well. There was a publication in 2012 that researched the prevention and treatment of antibiotic-associated diarrhea with probiotics. So here they took um, probiotics that consist of lactobacillus, bifidobacterium, saccharomyces, streptococcus, and so on. Oh yeah, bacillus is also there. And they found out that yes, there is an association with the reduction of um, antibiotic-associated diarrhea with probiotics. Probiotics are in fermented foods. Um, that would be, of course, raw sauerkraut, kimchi, kombucha, um, yogurt, of course, and you can have it in supplements as well. So what you could do, there are tons of recipes out there on the internet how to produce your own raw sauerkraut or kimchi or even your own coconut yogurt, which is a very delicious thing. So I will definitely do that. I've done a lot of sauerkraut um, in my salads, but I will also try around with making my own fermented foods. Um, you can also, of course, easily, especially the bifidum bacteria, um, you can get them in the supplements and they are a little bit more on the pricey side but yeah just try it out how you feel afterwards and i would suggest you if you have problems with diarrhea while taking antibiotics do it while you're taking it really to support your body but anyway it cannot be harmful to just support your gut flora in general with probiotics i will link all the some recipe sites in the description box below i hope this video was helpful for you Please leave your comments and ideas, suggestions down below. Hit the like button and the subscribe button if you don't already have. Subscribe to my channel for um, more of my videos. I will do daily vlogs now, my blank page um, series. And yeah, you can join me on this journey. I will pack um, information in each of those vlogs and you can just join me on my journey. Have a nice day, have a nice night wherever you are and I see you tomorrow.